In this video, I'm going to show you how you can automatically send Instagram posts directly to Discord, whether there are pictures or videos that will all be sent. For this, we will be using Zapier. Let's go to zapier.com and here you will need to create an account and you will also need to have your Instagram account that you want to send the posts from. And basically Zapier is going to send everything that you post on Instagram to your Discord as you saw earlier right here. Like this is the post and this is the video that I shared earlier. I guess, right? <laughs> so let's get to it. Basically, let's go to zapier.com and then we're going to create an account. I already have several accounts because I like Zapier. So once you create an account, we're going to create what it's called a Zap. There are a bunch of already pre-made Zaps, but let's just make it from scratch. That way we understand more what we're doing. So basically, we want to connect the two apps, Instagram and Discord. So connect this app. We're going to type in Instagram. We just select it right there. And then with this one, which will be Discord. So now let's set up the rules here where it says when this happens, we're going to select something. Let's say new media post from my account, right? And then do this. And then we're going to select what is going to happen on Discord. So we want it to send a channel message, right? So we have it set up. Let's click try it. So, yep, connect the app, set up this app and turn on this app. Good. So let's go ahead and connect our Instagram account. So I'm already logged in on my browser on my Instagram account. So I'm just going to click allow. Let's click next. So now we're going to connect Discord. Apparently I'm not logged in. I'm going to log in with the QR code to make it quicker. So let's select the server. I'm going to select my channel server. Oh, come on. Okay, so we already have the Zapier bot, but apparently we need to add it again. So basically you're just going to add the bot, which will have the administrator permissions to send messages and do all sorts of things. Okay, so we have it connected to our Discord server. Let's click next. And now we're going to select the channel where this will be sent. So I already have a channel called test tutorials test. So I'm going to click next. Now here's what we're going to do. So basically when the Zapier triggers, meaning when I post something on Instagram, this is going to trigger and basically trigger means that it will fire and it will happen. So when this happens, then we can select the different parts of what we wanted to send to Discord. So for example, here, if we just type hello, then it's just going to send hello when I post a picture, right? But we want to select several parts. So for example, you have the caption. If you only wanted to send the caption then you can select that the media url is going to be either the direct link for the picture or the video of the instagram post this will be the actual post itself which includes everything the profile the caption and everything else the username the id whatever timestamp so all that stuff um i tried up before we move forward i tried out the post and the post does share everything but it works better for pictures for some reason the videos don't play so i will choose instead to do the media url because that sends the video directly and those videos do play so that's why i'm not going to share the entire post if it's going to be pictures then the entire post it's recommended so let's just go with media url and then uh I'm not going to ping any user, so I'm going to leave that blank, text to speech blank. The bot username, I'm going to leave as the username of the account. And I wanted to have the picture or the profile picture of the account. So I'm going to go to my profile, right click on the picture and then click image link, copy image link. And then I'm going to paste this on bot icon. So I'm going to paste the link of the picture on bot icon. And now we can click next. So what Zapier does before turning it on is going to test it to see if it works. So basically, let me put this to the side and this to the side. So basically, it's giving you an overview, like check this out if everything is okay. Let's go ahead and click send test. And this is going to send the, the link. Here we go. It's sent. So let's open it big. After a while, it's going to actually load in the media. So basically what it sent was that last video that I have uploaded right there, as you can see. Oh. That's loud. Well, this is the video. Basically, let's play it. As you can see, it's the exact same video that we have last posted. So this is just a test. Now we can move on to turning it on so that it can send any future posts. So once you click turn on zap, then it's going to be active. And the next time you post something on this Instagram account is going to be sent directly to Discord. It sent another one, even though I didn't ask it to, but yeah, <laughs> apparently it works. So yeah, that's basically how that works. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.